We're going to go back to one of our biggest stories of the day, a closer look into what led up to five-year-old Taylor Williams' remains being found in Alabama. Her mother, Brianna Williams, we told you, is being charged with child neglect. That's in connection to her disappearance. Taylor Williams reporting missing in November, and then her remains were found in a wooded area about a week after an intense search. News for Jack supporter Corley Peel has been digging through the new evidence released by the state attorney's office today. Records show April 29th was the last time Taylor Williams attended daycare at Naval Air Station Jacksonville. Brianna Williams' neighbor told police he saw Taylor wandering outside their Southside apartment on May 21st. Brianna Williams told investigators she wasn't with Taylor from October 1st to 31st because Taylor was in Alabama with her grandparents. Williams put an ad on Craigslist on November 3rd looking for movers to help her move from her Southside apartment to her new home in Brentwood. On November 6th, Brianna Williams reports Taylor missing from their home in Brentwood. A massive search for the five-year-old took place on the Southside and in Brentwood. During that time, investigators found Brianna Williams' phone records proved she was in Alabama on October 31st, November 1st, and November 2nd. Taylor's grandparents told police Taylor never stayed with them in October. Williams returned to Jacksonville at 5.28 a.m. on November 3rd, six hours before she posted an ad for movers on Craigslist. The movers told police they never saw a child at the apartment. A GPS tracker on Williams' car led detectives to finding Taylor's remains in Alabama a week after she disappeared in Jacksonville. That same day, police say Williams tried to kill herself by ingesting an unknown substance. This video shows a moment after investigators say William took the substance. I hate watching bad news and stuff like that on the news. And I hate going back and forth with it, where everything's going on. Um, but, you know, now they're saying that you're a person of interest now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, I mean, why would it? Oh, oh open, the, open, the, open the door, open the door, open That was Corley Peel reporting. At this time, it's unclear exactly how Taylor Williams died. We filed an open records request for her autopsy report. Her mother was in court today, but she has another pretrial hearing scheduled for March 24th.